Jelly is here to turn incidents into learning opportunities. We take multiple sources of data and present them to you in a format where you can start making sense of your incidents. You can uncover, understand, and share the story of an incident, either to export a report or keep it as a searchable record in Jelly. Let's start by uncovering what happened in Narrative Builder. Through our Slack integration, we've pulled in the transcript of an incident. You can filter messages by participant, Slack reaction, sources, and tags, or get acclimated to the incident by reading through the transcript. Here's our first message indicating a problem has been detected. Let's mark it as a plot point in this story. There are four marker types. Detection, for telling the story of how we detected and discovered problems. Diagnosis, for when we're forming hypotheses and collecting information. Repair, for our efforts made to reduce impact or mitigate the issue and key moments, our flexible marker for calling out interesting, important, or relevant things that fall outside the other three. For this marker, we'll select detection, since Natalie is first reporting customer impact. We'll pull over the Slack message to add evidence, which will automatically set the time, and we'll write a summary of what this moment was within the incident. We'll add any notes or questions we may want to ask responders in an interview or during our learning review meeting. Every incident is different so your investigation process needs to be flexible and adapt to each story. You might use the same type of marker multiple times or not at all. Jelly is here to make learning from incidents accessible. We'll help you understand the events of an incident as they unfolded and talk to the people who worked through it so that you can learn how your technologies and people work together and generate insights from your incidents to help improve your organization's performance. Now let's find some additional context about our responders in the People tab. This is a quick way to learn about our responders. On the map, we can see them based on time zone. There's a three hour difference between Greg and Natalie, so immediately I know they were at very different points in their day during response. For even more details, we can scroll down to see roles, tenure, and on-call schedules, even how much they participated in the conversation. Right away, I can see Becca wasn't on call, but I just created a detection marker of her noticing an issue. So now I have more context and maybe some more questions. Let's hop into an opportunity that's ready for the learning review. In the overview here, I can see the start and end times and edit our executive summary. I like to think of this as the description you'd see in the TV guide if this were an episode of a TV show. Next, we'll run the learning review from our narrative. We can use the timeline to find interesting points. We have two repair efforts happening at the same time. We can click on a point in the timeline to view the evidence and add notes during the review meeting. They'll autosave if you click into another marker. Then we'll head into our takeaways and document the themes or learnings we earned through our experience responding and investigating this incident. Next, we'll head into our action items to document the follow-ups we'd like to see. And each of these sections are marked down compatible so you can custom format them. Finally, we'll head to our report. We believe incident reports should be read, not filed away. So we've made it so you can customize the content for your audience. Then share the link, export it as a PDF, print it out, or build a campfire and recount it in a spooky voice with a flashlight under your chin. Every incident is an opportunity that reveals how your organization really works. Don't waste that opportunity. Make the most of it with Jelly.